Thanks for joining us today at Island Ford Superstore located on Norcross Road in Duncan, BC off the Trans-Canada Highway. We're in the Couchin Valley on Vancouver Island and you can visit us online at islandford.ca for more information and a full description of this vehicle. Today we're looking at a 2020 Escape SEL in ingot silver with black ActiveX material seating for five, four doors and a hatch. This has a 1.5 litre three cylinder engine with cylinder deactivation. It's also an all wheel drive and an EcoBoost. It also also has navigation as well as backup camera and sensors and it also has lane keeping. It's really easy to get into this vehicle. Just talk to our sales team. They'd be happy to take you out on a test drive and you can book that online at islandford.ca. Storage and speaker in the door as well as power locks, windows and mirrors. It also has memory for three drivers. The driver's seat is powered with lumbar and is made with the ActiveX material. This is a long lasting durable material. It's man made and has no animal byproducts. It's stain resistant and water resistant. Your lighting controls are located here and your lift gate release is here. The steering wheel can tilt and telescope and on the face of it is your, da is your um, adaptive cruise control with stop and go, volume control, menu, as well as sync voice activated system. You also have lane keeping, that's your little vehicle in between the dotted lines. And this is a push start, so my foot's on the brake, keys in the pocket, and we're going to push our engine start stop button. On your dash, any important messages will appear, and you also have a menu that you can toggle through. So we're seeing trip one there, you can then go into my view, driver assist, navigation, Sirius XM, phone, information, and back around again. In the center, we're seeing the display screen, and you can touch on it for different options. Audio, there's your sources, AM, FM, Sirius satellite radio, as well as Bluetooth. There's your navigation again, you saw that in your menu, and you can also touch on here, then you'll see your map. And when you put the vehicle in reverse, this is where you're going to see your backup camera view. There you go. And then you can go into settings and slide through for different options. And there we go. You have your Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, Apple CarPlay, and so forth. There's your volume and tuner, hazard lights. Down below is your climate control. And so you have heated seats for both driver and passenger, as well as a heated steering wheel, front and rear defrost as well as your AC and max AC and you're seeing the display is a digital one. Below you have your 12 volt and USB outlet and you have a dial shifter, electronic parking brake and your auto hold. So for instance if you're on an incline, your foot's on the brake, you can push the auto hold. This stops your vehicle from rolling forwards or backwards. This is your drive mode and when we press on that it appears on your dash, so normal, eco, sport, sn slippery, and snow sand and then back around again auto stop start for less idle time you have a couple of cup holders your armrest opens up and inside lots of room in there plus you've got a usb outlet off to the side is your glove compartment up above is your manually dimming rear view mirror there's your lighting controls you also have a sunglass holder and there's a grab handle on the passenger side making it easier to get in 18 inch wheels body color door handle with intelligent access meaning when the fobs in close proximity you can lock and unlock your doors and keyless entry keypad driver's side capless easy fuel gas filler in the back there's a little bit of a spoiler and a windshield wiper and just below the escape badge is your backup camera you also have backup sensors on your bumper dual exhaust and when you're ready to open up that hatch you can do so by double clicking your fob your power releases it for you and inside it's nice and roomy you've got tabs to be able to tether things there's a light off to the side and on this side you've got your 12 volt and then when you're ready to close everything up you can give it a kick you can use the handle or you can press the button it'll chime for you to let you know it's going down securely and then you can just lock it up and walk away or jump in and head out on your latest adventure and on your fob you have remote start and speaker in the door as well as power windows. They're seating for three in the back with a 60-40 split. You can bring down the headrest simply by pushing the button and then pull the lever at the base of the seat and it'll come right down. You now have access to the back cargo area and on the back of the seat are anchors to be able to tether baby seats. Then simply give it a push back into the upright position and flip up your headrest. In the center there's an armrest with a couple of cup holders and the nice thing about this seat too is that you've got these levers underneath so you can 
pull your seat forwards and backwards. I can't do it with one hand. You also have carpeted mats on the floor, some pockets on the back of the front seat, and in the center you have air vents as well as a 12 volt. Up above, hooks, handles, and lighting. Privacy glass in the back windows, black roof rails, heated and powered side view mirrors with blind spot information system, halogen headlights, fog lights, and so many more reasons to visit us at Island Ford Superstore, BC's number one rated Ford dealer.